Hi guys, it's Christy from 418 and I have a quick project I'm going to do and I thought I would share. Um, I have this towel that I like that I got from Target recently, um, a couple months back actually. And I have the problem where it always slips off the oven handle. So I've decided to Velcro the sides just along the edges so that it won't fall off, it won't slip off. So I got this Velcro Fabric Fusion um, to where you can just heat attach it at Michael's and I don't remember how much it was it wasn't too expensive and it comes with both strips so it comes with um, both sides and then you cut it to the size that you want it so here's if you can see it's the one side here's the other kind I don't know if you can tell the difference and I'm just going to get the iron and heat adhesive it to both sides I don't know if you can see very well, but I'm going to try to let you see as I do this. Oh, okay. So I have my iron here. And... I'm going to cut this tag off. This is not very good. I have another pair here too. Okay, now I am going to, there's this sticky stuff in the back, and so I'm just going to take that off, if I can get it off, okay, it's taking me a second, sorry. All right. So it just comes off like a sticker. Take that off. And then place it on the bottom. So you can see I'm just putting it on the bottom here. So I flip the towel over because I want it to be on the back side so you can't see it. And then I'm just going to cut off that little excess. I cut it a bit too long. Okay, hopefully you can see everything I'm doing. So now I'm just going to flip it over and I'm going to put a cloth on top of it because that's what it says to do. This is just a microfiber cloth. And I have my iron and I'm just going to go over it, steaming it. Not really steaming. Hopefully my iron's not broken. Who knows? I it dropped, and as you can see, I had a duct tape a piece of it. But hey, it does the job usually. So just keep going over it a little bit. It says, and I'm gonna move this over and do the other side. I don't think it's hot enough. I can. Keep I think I can go right on the towel because I don't think it's too hot. I'm not sure having the fabric on top of it is helping. Alright, it says to do it for about a minute. I don't know if I did it long enough. And then it says just to kind of tug on it. So it's not good yet. I want it more. I don't know. My iron doesn't feel hot enough, so that could be the problem here. But and on the edges, I think I'm gonna have to go a little bit extra because the corners, as you can tell, you know, on towels they sew it extra, so the corners are just a little bit more pad on them. So I think I'm gonna have to just go over it a little bit more. All right, now let me try. Still not good. Okay, I think this is better.
I just keep checking it. So that side feels good. Can't lift it. Alright, so now it's good. So I know that I want it to attach behind here. So now I need to put it on this side so that it attaches right. So again, I'm going to grab the other one, take the tape off of it. Put it on this side. Sorry if you hear my husband in the background. He's on the phone. Alright. And now I'm going to flip this over and do the same thing. I'm just trying to put the steam on it. Kind of working now. All right. Don't forget the edges, a little bit extra, like that. Okay, and then check it. And it's a little long. I don't know if you can tell, but it's a little long, so I'm going to cut it. All right. Now I can velcro it and it's one circle. If you can see that, see it's one loop. So now I can put it on the oven, which I'll take pictures of for you and put it below or I'll put the link to the blog if this is on YouTube and you can see how it won't fall off. Anyway, just a quick project that will make things easier for you. Thanks. Bye.